In Google Cloud, projects are generally tied to an organization in the resource hierarchy. Now, situations like acquisitions or reorganizations or handoffs from partners may require you to migrate projects from one Google Cloud organization to another or migrate an orgless project. Let's face it, project migrations can seem sort of intimidating, but I have good news. Google Cloud Resource Manager enables you to migrate projects from one organization to another with ease. Let's get started on our journey with migrating a project by taking a quick look at the key steps. First, create a migration plan. Second, assign IAM permissions at the right levels. Next, configure organization policies on both the source and destination organizations. Then, handle any special cases. Finally, migrate the projects between organizations. For migrating a project, it's important to evaluate if there will be any impact to services running inside that project. So use Cloud Asset Inventory to create an overview of resources in use in the project, including IAM policies applied to them. Verify and ensure that the effective policies at the destination organization align with your governance objectives and match what's at the source. Check if your project has a customer-managed encrypted key or any cloud key management service enabled on it. You need to keep this in mind as it will be required once you start operating your project in the destination organization after migration. If you have any preview features enabled on your project, then ensure that these features are not private and are allow listed for the destination organization to allow smooth functioning of the feature. Ensure that you have the relevant IAM permissions and set the required organization policies so that you can roll back the project migration if you observe any issues after migration. Policy inheritance can cause unintended effects when you are migrating a project, both in the source as well as destination organizations. You can mitigate this risk by creating specific folders to hold only those projects that you want to export and import and ensure that the same policies are applied to both. Let's assume we have two organizations called Acme and Bonsai with the resource hierarchy as shown in this representation. I will now show you how to move the project titled Development Project from the Acme organization to the Bonsai organization. Go to the Manage Resources page in the Google Cloud Console. Set up a dedicated source folder called Export to New Organization. Set up a dedicated Import folder in the Destination organization. On both these folders, assign the Project Mover role to the person responsible for migrations. This role will then be inherited by any projects that are contained within these folders. To migrate a project between organizations, you must have the following roles on different entities. Project Mover role on the project's parent resource, which could be either a folder or organization, and Project Mover role on the destination resource if it's a folder. Project Creator role on the destination resource if it's an organization. Project IAM admin role on the project that you want to migrate. Additionally, ensure that the user setting the organization policies has the org policy admin role on both the source and destination resources to enable creation and management of organization policies. Next, you need to set the appropriate organization policies on the source and destination resources to allow export and import of projects respectively. For this, Set the policy that includes allowed export destinations constraint on the project's parent resource, which sets up the destination as a valid location to which the project can be migrated. Similarly, set the allowed import sources constraint on the destination resource. This sets up the source as a valid location from which the project can be migrated. Note that your environment may consist of some special cases such as the ones listed here for which you must follow additional steps before you can do the migration. Refer to this documentation to learn about all the special cases and to follow relevant instructions for your environment. Finally, you can migrate the projects using Google Cloud CLI or APIs. Okay, so we are here at the final step of our migration journey. I will now run the move command in the Google Cloud CLI to migrate our project development project from organization Acme to another organization Bonsai.
And there you have it. We have successfully migrated the project development project. To learn more about Resource Manager and migrating projects between organizations, check out the following documentation. Thank you for watching.